Hey there, this is Christy Ashcraft from Christy's Leads. I was doing some research in your niche, in your area, Philly, and I thought I'd shoot you the screencast to show you how you're doing online, just from what I could gather online. I'm outside of Philly, I'm right in Fort Washington, so Montgomery County, not Bucks County. Uh, if you're interested in learning more about how um, Christy's Leads could help grow your business, I'd love to hear from you. Please reach out via phone, email, or text. If not, no harm, no foul. Any comments on the video are greatly welcome. So I'm going to go over a couple things today. First, content and keywords. Second, citations and map pack. And third, organic rank and backlinks. So I'm going to start with your front page here of your website. Your website looks great. Awesome images. Your services. Awesome pictures. Um, it's always nice to have a friendly face. Some of the work you did. Looks great. Laid out very well. Um, beautiful work. Stunning. So believe it or not, the way your images are saved counts as content. So this should be saved as something like kitchen, re kitchen remodeling Philadelphia. Those kind of words are usually highly searched and relevant to your niche, exactly what you're doing. So we generally put 1,500 words of content on our front page. Within those 1,500 words, we scatter about 8 to 10 keywords that are highly searched and relevant to your niche. And we do a lot of research on those to find out what it is. That way, Google understands what you're trying to serve. So when people search for kitchen remodelers, Bucks County, PA, you want to have that throughout your website in the right spots so that they know that you want to rank for that. So that's kind of, that's one of the things we definitely do. The second thing I'm going to talk about is citations and map pack. So I Google searched remodelers in Philadelphia, remodeling contractors. I could have done home remodelers, Philadelphia. I could have done home remodeling, Bucks County. There's lots of different ways. There's lots of ways that people search for what they want, but in different ways. Again, home remodeling contractors, Philadelphia. I could have just added a PA. I could have put in Philly. So I just did this. This right here is the map pack. I'm going to talk about that right now. You want to be in the map pack, the top spot not with the ad. In order to get to the top spot, you have to have more citations than your competitors. This goes on for pages. It's good to be in the map pack because look, it usually has your phone number, has your website, tells you where you are. People click on it a lot. Those citations are just your business name, address, and phone number appearing in online directories. And we have a program that lets us see all of those. So an online directory is something like Angie's List, Yelp, Yellow Pages. You want to be out there because then Google says, hey, I trust this business because they're linking themselves a lot. So they pump you up and bring you to the top of the map pack. And you just got to stay there. So we manage that monthly. So the last thing we're going to talk about are backlinks and organic rank. So in addition to being in the map pack, you want to be top organically, which means the first business without an ad. Yelps, BBBs, they don't count. So in this case, it's D, uh, D remodeling out of Philly. So you want to be in that spot. In order to get there, you have to have a lot of power and relevance. So your content matters and your backlinks. A backlink is another website that links back to yours. So it could be a blog about home remodeling and someone mentions your company. They post your link. That link is the backlink. The blog is their referring domain. So here you are. This is a program we use, AREFs. Um, this is you guys, and this gives us some insight. You have four backlinks and two referring domains. You definitely want a lot of these and high quality, all of which we have. doesn't look like you're appearing for many keywords and not generating much traffic. You might be on like the fourth or fifth, fifth page for words like I just searched, and usually those get no visitors. So I wanted to compare you to Mr. Contractor who was in the map pack. He has 640 backlinks and they have 127 referring domains. Ranking for 164 keywords and bringing in 226 visitors a month. Let me just show you some of the keywords he's ranking for that you could be ranking for and ones you want to be in the top spot for. You definitely want to be in the top one, two, or three because that guarantees you the first page. Anything after that could be page two. Seven, eight, nine, they're generally page two. And like, 12, 13, 14, they're page three. And, and your website just doesn't do much for you at that point. So Contractors Philadelphia, we would put that in your web page and in strategic spots. It has a search volume of 500, which is extremely healthy. A low KD, which means it's not going to cost very much to rank for that with the strength of the backlinks. And this business is in spot 10. This is Mr. Contractor. It's doing nothing for him. 
contractor Philadelphia. See, there's a difference, less search volume, but still good search volume, spot eight. Window capping contractors near me, very specific. If that was something you would do, we would get you to the top spot in that so that you're always appearing for it. So you can kind of see what we're getting at here. So you want to rank for keywords so people can find you for exactly what you're trying to do. I hope the video was helpful. That's the end. If you want to learn more about how Christie's Leads can help grow your business, please reach out via phone, email, or text. We'd love to hear from you. And if not, no harm, no foul. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.